one second. Saw it in the hallway. <laughs> I was just telling Sue Bird that I have salsa <laughs> breath. That's what's happening. The Seattle Storm are playing in a new home this season using Angel of the Winds Arena and Everett, while Key Arena is being renovated, as you know. The reigning WNBA champions were dealt a blow when they learned one of their leaders, point guard Sue Bird, would need to have knee surgery and miss a good chunk of the season. But as Sue works to strengthen her knee, she remains a positive force to her teammates, and fans are gearing up for a special night to celebrate their Sue per hero. I I think Good it's plan. fun. So yeah. please welcome back, Sue Bird. Which knee are you okay? This guy. Yeah, that I'm one. good. And I'm doing what well. did you have done? Um, so basically, <laughs> over time, like it's hard to explain. <laughs> it wasn't just like you know something broke or tore. It wasn't like that, which yep. was great news. But basically, over time, I kind of developed this like bony, loose body. It, it wasn't loose in that it was floating, but it was like this thing that was extra, and they just had to take it out. They had to go find it. And, yeah, and, and take get it, it out. out yeah. yeah. So I have like you can't see, but I have a nice little scar on the mm. side. War wound. War wound. I don't so mind. exactly, our scars are mind. our stories. So what are you doing rehab-wise? Um, I mean, I'm not even. Tomorrow will be two weeks, so it's still pretty new. Seriously? Yeah, I just got. My stitches out on Monday, so that's when you can start to, you know, move and yeah. sweat. Um, so yeah, just the basics: range of motion, strengthening. Boring, boring, yeah, boring. But, but has you got to do it. Yeah. So uh, when that happens, and you know, you realize you've got that ahead of you. What is that? What is that feeling like when it happens? And how do you kind of draw strength and get ready for this? Yeah. Um, well, luckily I've been through it before. Yes. You know, this answer might have been different when I was 18 or 19, but you just have to understand that once the surgery happens, it's actually a little bit of a relief. Like, all right. Now I can get going, yeah. right? Leading up to that, you're kind of a little anxious. You're waiting, you're waiting. And then the minute that happens and you, you come out of the recovery room, you're like, all right, and now it's, it's go time. And you just have to understand there's, there's the longer goal, mm -hmm. but the only way to get there is to just to focus on today. And it's like so cliche. It's so much easier said than done, but you got to get caught up in the marginal gains and like yep. really find like value in those and it's then you can kind of move forward it's with it. It's interesting how many elite athletes have said, you know, basically that philosophy of mm -hmm. I'll pay attention to what I need to write a hundred percent of me devoted to this. I'm not going to worry about the ancillary things, the down the road that right. I can't control. Mm -hmm. um, such a good kind of metaphor for life. I'm yeah. trying to learn about that a little bit more. Speaking of life, <laughs> so your significant other scored yeah. uh, a goal yesterday in a game that had a record breaking outcome. Um, were you were you watching on TV? Uh, yeah, <laughs> yeah, for sure. Watching. Is Absolutely. it hard to kind of watch long distance? Um, yeah, you know, it's in some ways it's 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 hard because you want to be there. It's yeah. so exciting. I'm sure the atmosphere. I know her whole family's there. Um, then it's probably easier because I'm not quite as. I feel like when you're in a stadium or an arena, it's you can like it's emotional. There's highs, there's lows. Right. When I'm on my couch, I'm just like, okay, they got this. <laughs> you know, I have like more perspective. Are um, you going to go at all during the World Cup? We'll see. We actually, the storm actually has. A, we have a break. So even before my surgery, we have a break in our schedule where we don't play a game for a week. I, I don't even know how it happened, and it's the exact same time as the final. I could literally fly to Paris or Leon actually, get back, and I wouldn't miss a thing. A practice, a game, nothing. I feel like that's so pretty crazy. good. Yeah. So I looked this up. Tell me if I'm right. You've got four Olympic gold medals mm -hmm. and two WNBA titles. No biggie. Um, Megan has a gold medal from the Olympics and a silver and gold from um, World Cups. Mm -hmm. So that's kind of a lot of hardware in yeah. one in one household. <laughs> it is. It and, is. And I read that she said abs are made in the kitchen. And I thought, no wonder yeah. I can't find mine. Those are... <laughs> <laughs> Salsa's not bad though, so it's a good start. Salsa has got There's some good stuff in it. There's salsa out there as you, as you go on your way. So has it been weird playing in a new place or have you guys just kind of um, let it go? Yeah, I think we roll with the punches, you know. Our fans have been great. They followed us out there. We, we probably, have, probably have developed some new fans in Everett. Um, it's it's obviously different, you know. Um, for us, Key Arena was right down the street, yeah. so it and made for home. like yeah, it was home for a long time for me, especially a very long time. But um, Everett's been great; they've been welcoming. The arena's great, good. so we've had some some good crowds, some good wins. That's always a good thing. It's kind of cool up good. there. Now we're going to do something with you, um, the superhero. We have a photo mm -hmm. that shows that you may have been hiding your talents from uh -oh. a very young age. <laughs> Apparently, <gasps> uh, fans are very into the superhero thing. We'll look for that. There you go. Oh uh, yeah. There, there you are. <laughs> <laughs> um, fear the mask is a thing that is actually a thing that has to do with your broken nose from last year. Can yeah. you tell us more about that? Um, you know, I've, I've broken my nose now like a handful of times. Yeah. And is it always somebody's elbow? Usually, yeah. yeah. Um, sometimes it's been opposing players. Two times it's been my own teammate. Oh my <laughs> this last time Friendly was Brianna fire. Stewart. Yeah. So, but yeah, both times um, that I broke, or two of the times I should say that I broke my nose 
was during playoffs. So in 2004 yep. and then 2018. Yep. And both times the fans like rallied around my mask and rallied around. They got little exactly. band-aids made. Everyone's all about it. Um, I, I think know. that's super me, fun. Yeah, that it's sort been of give amazing. You, get get you pumped. The now, the, how hard is it to play in the mask? Um, it, at at first, it was. It's just more of a nuisance. It's like it kind of blocks your vision. It gets mm -hmm. really hot in there. And at this point, I'm used to it. And in some ways. It kind of makes you feel a little more feel it. like you can go out there. I'm not afraid of getting hit in the face anymore, which right. I think human nature, you, you enter right. a position and it's kind of like, oh, I might get hit. You kind of retreat. Right. This, I'm just like sticking my nose in places I don't mind. I think that's so, great. It sort yeah, of reminds me nice. of Cam Chancellor, the way he would wear his helmet. With yeah, the, yeah. I think it's kind of fierce. Um, so what's happening on the Fear the Fear the Mask night? What's the yeah, celebration? Yeah, so it's superhero super. night. And um, yeah, I think just uh, an opportunity to have some fun with the fact that I had to wear this, this mask. Um, that everyone has rallied everybody around knows. it. Yeah, everybody Super knows. Superheroes wear now. masks. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, so we encourage the fans to come out, wear their own costumes. I think we're gonna have like a costume contest for kids. That sounds so um, Just so have fun. fun with it, you know? So I think fun. it's just a way to kind of, a good reminder of, of what, of how much fun last year was when we won, but also just a good time to uh, Winning is fun, isn't it? it? I mean, nothing better. Turns out that that's super nothing fun. Better. All right, well, I wish you all the best Thank in you. your I recovery. You look like you're doing great. I was afraid to give yeah. you a hug. I was like, don't hurt her in any <laughs> way whatsoever. It's good to see good you to again. See you too. Thanks for appreciate having me. Appreciate it.